Welcome to the Athletic Grounds in Armagh for the opening game of the 2014 season for the Orchard County, where they entertain today Queen's University Belfast in the Dr McKenna Cup. Our referee today hails from Fermanagh, it's Martin Higgins, and we're now ready to get proceedings underway. So the ball's through in, and it breaks for Armagh, but the referee says that's a free, it's going to be a free to the visitors from Queen's. Led down in towards the corner, Gary McCoy lets it go and Queen's will be playing with the advantage of the breeze in the first half. Ball comes loose and Kieran Tonin does well and lays it off. Charlie Vernon plays it to Ethan Rafferty who's got time to move the ball forward. That's a great pass looking for Niall McConville there. McConville takes a look, loses possession for a moment. Bit of a stumble but holds on to the ball, gets it away and that'll be a free in. So good recovery there from Niall McConville. Plays it inside. And Queen's trying to launch an attack at own, and that's a good ball inside. And a quick turn and shot from Ryan Rafferty from the Greenmore Club. Rafferty with something to prove today, certainly. And he gets the first score of the game after two and a half minutes. Kick out from Gagan, caught in the wind there. You can see the, the benefit of the wind that Queen's have, and Tony Donnelly has it. And he plays a drills a high, high ball in. Where's that one going? Well, that's a great score in, in, in the early minutes here. Two hour man men that have. Got valuable scores for Queen's, and after three minutes, there are two points to the good. And now Ethan Rafferty shot from the full forward line, looking for McConville. But it's gathered there by that's good work there by McGeever. It goes out to the far side of Tasker. Tasker now turns and takes a shot and steers that one right between the post. That's an encouraging start from Robbie Tasker. Fifth minute of the game. And Tasker opens Armagh's account for 2014. It's well gathered in by number 23 there. And that just goes over the bar. The scorer on this occasion is Ryan Murray from Lavderg in Antrim. Works his way inside towards 21. McVurry comes out to help. Steers it up into the corner. That's a good ball looking for Tasker. Tasker gathers it in, but very close to the corner. Plays it backwards. That's a great pass looking for Brian Mullen. Brandman plays it inside. That might be an opportunity here for Armand. Now McConville gets the ball away. It's still there for McGeever. Can McGeever add another point to his name? He does indeed. Patient and accurate build up there from Armand. The opening was eventually created for Oshin McGeever, and he coolly slotted the ball between the posts for his second score of the game. But Stephen Campbell wins the race to keep it in, just very close to the touchline. Fades the first challenge, may elect to play it backwards and does, finds McConville, McConville creates a bit of space for himself this time and Cooley slots it over the bar, that's a great score for McConville, just on the edge of half time. And Murray gets it back, that's good work between him and Ryan Mallon. And again Murray, the recipient of a pass, makes a bit of space, Kelly tied up just on the edge of half time, that's great interactive play. The goal went down half the field and Murray the scorer, so four points for Murray in the first half and he's been one of the stars of the show here and referee moving just towards the ball and now he blows his whistle and at half time in this Dr McKenna Cup tie it's Armagh eight points and Queen's eight points Armagh to play with the advantage of a strong breeze in the second period Ran Murray to add to the four points he's got in the first half and give Queen's the lead again right at the start of the second period and he does so successfully Campbell Campbell in turn gives it to Stephen Harold just outside the 45 now Campbell gets it back gives it again to Harold Harold's got a shooting chance and steers that one calmly between the posts for his first score of the game puts the accuracy on and the wing does the rest and our man moves to two points clear 11-9 for the Orchard County in this opening McKenna Cup tie. Corker does well. Has it back to Campbell. Campbell turns. The plays a high, high challenge and ball. Brand Mullins under. Gathers it well. The ball bubbles. Oh, McConville puts it in the net. Now McConville at the second attempt finds the net. It's ball split. It's all good strong play here by Harry O'Connor. And now an opportunity for Ryan Rafferty. He likes to take his point. Spread across there by Moynan. Clock running thin though, but Tony Donnelly lays it off. 
And that's another score from the Grabby there. And we're well into the moment of injury time at our Fermanagh official today. Martin Higgins will be allowed. And indeed, there it goes, the full-time whistle. A successful first inning for 2014 for Armagh. They beat Queen's by 117 to 15 points in this Dr McKenna Cup tie at the Athletic Grounds in Armagh.